My name is Mel Spence and I'm head mixologist at Rick's Bar in Edinburgh. As head mixologist I comprise cocktail lists, create cocktails, enter competitions representing Rick's Bar and Montpellier as a whole and also lead a bar team of four, um, some highly experienced and highly creative mixologists. The style of drinks we're serving at Rick's and the atmosphere that we have now at Rick's is very unique in Edinburgh and we're serving drinks that have not been made for a long time and a style that's not been done in a long time. The new list at Rick's is undertaking uh, four different themes in four different eras, that being Havana, Cuba, Manhattan, New York, uh, New Orleans and British Imperial style drinks. The main theory behind these four different eras and four different themes is basically all cocktails can be taken to an era and a time um, where the cocktails were very unique and very particular. We also do punch bowls at Rick's and uh, some of these punch bowls date back to the, as early as the 15, 1600s. Some of them are stirred and some of them are shaken. And obviously because of the quantity and the size of the punch bowls, we have to uh, shake them in a considerably larger shaker. And this brings us to the cobbler shaker that we've managed to source. Um, they're very, very hard to get a hold of, simply because of the size, because they're, um, because of silver as well. But um, we managed to source one from New York and uh, this is a way of mixing maybe one or two of the punch bowls. We hand freeze the rice at Rick's here. Um, we also have other blocks as well and we have moulds specifically for the punch bowls. The reason why we hand freeze our own ice is mainly to control every aspect of the drink. Um, a cocktail is only as strong as its weakest ingredient. Nine times out of ten that the weakest ingredient in a cocktail is the ice. This is why we've taken it upon ourselves to take control of the production of the ice. These are aspects that um, you don't really see being used in a lot of British bars, especially Scottish bars and more importantly Edinburgh bars. Some of the techniques that we've brought on board, specifically for the new launch and for the relaunch, are techniques that have maybe go back 200 years, especially with the, the hand, cut, hand cut ice. So it's something that's very, very unique, especially Edinburgh, Scotland and the UK as a whole.